What is up, everybody? This is your host, Superside, and welcome back to another video. Now, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make these very, very quickly. So, I'm going to be showing you the top 10 ways to make, to make lots, to get lots of nails, lots of planks, lots of panels, lots of expansion items, lots of upgrading items for the barn and whatnot. So, I'm going to be showing you the top 10 ways how to do it this video. So, there's many good ways to do it. I've currently got a barn that's 2,000 in size, approximately, I think a bit bigger. So, I'll come over and I'll show you my barn now. Now, I know there's players with high barns, but this is these are some of the quick ways you can do it. So I've got a barn with 2,500 space and a silo with 2,700 space. So better than most people for this level, but still could be improved on. So the first way to make lots and lots of barn ex like items that can be expanded out in many different ways. For example, you know, like the the mallets and whatnot, as well as the planks, the bolts, and the tape, is indeed to do wheating. So wheating is a it's a profitable as well so we'll sell off some wheat and then I'll show you how it's done so basically all you have to do with weeding which most of you already know how to do it is just harvest and just keep harvesting now there's many different things it gives you sometimes it will give you uh, like a plank sometimes it'll give you a mining equipment but it still is it's some sort of supply or whatnot but you can't control exactly what you get but normally you get approximately one per harvest depending on how many fields you have so for example if we put all of these up for sale right now and then we come down here and we harvest the strawberries like this. Now, see, if we do this, there's a tool. See, we just got one right there. We got a tape right there. And if we plant these here in two minutes, then we'll get to harvest those again. And then there'll be another tool. And so we might end up getting a, another plank or another tape or whatnot. Now the second way, which is a very awesome way to get lots and lots of tools, is indeed in the Daily Dirt, in the little newspaper that you unlock at le level 7. So if we go through here, we can quickly check through here. Now some, oh, see right here, there's a, there's, oh, so it's sold, but there are indeed sometimes items in there that you can buy. Now not always, only sometimes, but I have got awesome amounts of items many, many times, which is always very, very good, because you can, you can buy, you can buy up to 80 per day, and yeah, there's a, if you if you go through like lots and lots of newspapers, often you end up finding them, and I've I've find I've found like forty plus items from one player at one time, which can be awesomely beneficial. Okay, now the next way in order to make lots and lots of tools, see the wheat's coming ready and then we can harvest that, is indeed via the town visitors. Now town visitors are really awesome and provide you with heaps and heaps of different tools. So for example, here we go, these ones, these are visitors are here because I've fed them and whatnot. So if we tap them right there, they will give us what's it going to be. Okay, so that one still has another one to go. This guy here, he's ready. So look, there we go. We get wooden panels from doing that. So there's another tool. And then there's another guy right here. So what's he going to give us? That time it's a deed so it's expansion it's not the specific barn or silo upgrade and she's going to give nails so as you can see getting lots and lots of different people helping out right here and then if you feed them like so you can send them to the beach calf and they'll come over here there's some more so there we go we get a map from them and from them we get that and then if we feed them which we currently haven't got the food then they'll give us a tool every single time now sometimes it's a deed sometimes it's a plank but either way it's something beneficial every time so that's a super good way to do it as well as if they visit via the sanctuary then you can also see there's a tool right there from feeding the animals so that's really really awesome and so that's a tool right there and when they visit the sanctuary they sometimes leave items like this here so you can get panels so look at all the stuff we're getting in just such a short amount of time okay so they are some of the, the other uh, th three ways now the next way is indeed pets now i haven't got any pets myself at the moment in fact we'll just check through the daily oh, okay wait oh let's see and but sometimes it like farms that aren't even on the like that haven't got to see and then we'll harvest this we'll harvest this wheat here and there we go, there's another tape. And so if you just keep doing that, you can get a new a new item every single two minutes, just about, depending on how many you have. And it's really, really beneficial and really, really awesome to be able to get do that. So with it, with pets, uh, you can buy them uh, via here. And you come in here. Oh, not, not that one there, down here. And there's cats you can get. You can get dogs or horses or donkeys. And so you do need to... You do indeed need the stable in that. Wait, where's the stable here? Oh, it's down here. So, for example, you can get a donkey stable or puppy house or whatnot. And if you keep feeding those animals, they give you lots and lots of tools. So that is an awesome epic way in order to get tools via doing that. Now, the next way, which is an awesome way to get tools, is indeed from 
buying them from friends. So, for example, I have, and sometimes, sometimes Greg, well, does Greg, no, he doesn't have those, does he? No, so, but if you go through your friends, so I recommend having lots of friends, because if you have lots of friends, sometimes, not always, but sometimes, they'll put them up for sale. So, I don't know if I'll find any in this. I'll just look through a few of them and see. See, there's some maps. It's not quite the same as blanks or panels, but I do see that sold some nails back there. I do often see... I'd say on a daily basis, uh, with with lots of friends. So if you have if you have like 200 plus friends, oh, we can't even buy that such a profitable thing right there. I do often see them selling off different things: axes, saws, sometimes planks, sometimes nails, sometimes panels, and then it's awesome because yeah, see like right there. Look at that! Look at that right there. So W F. There we go. There's 20 right there. So we come back here. We'll sell off some of this like so. And we'll sell off some ice creams like so. And we'll come back here. And oh, that's awesome. I did not know in, in advance from this video that they had that. We come back here. And there we go. We just got 20 items right there. And there are drills for the town there also, which I could collect if I so wish. So that is another awesome way to do it. Now, another way. So, so many good ways. There's so many good ways. So there we go. And there's this again. So we can check through. We can check through. And currently not in this issue. But yeah. And you can. Yeah. Okay. And so there you go. So now, now we're going to have to free up a little bit of space for this next thing and so get rid of some goat goat milk like that and get rid of some fish soup oh there's another fish soup so we'll just collect that one there another fish soup like that and so another way to get uh, them is indeed from harvesting animals now you don't get it every time but you sometimes get it and there we go so not in that batch what about this time there we go not that time we'll, ha we'll, we'll keep feeding them and we'll see we might if we're lucky for this example get one so so far no but we can, there's still more, there we go, there's still more chance that we can get it, if we keep, and there we go, so, and eventually, eventually you'll get it, so there we go, like five, hey, there we go, right there, right there, there's a deed, awesome, 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 just enough for the example, so, doing animals, feeding animals, harvesting animals, is indeed, the harvesting part of it, is indeed a great way to get it, okay, so we're, we're, we're filling up with lots of space for the example, but that's okay, and then we'll sell off that one right there, and so do that, okay, now, another really good one is indeed mystery boxes, and the town box so we'll just look around now they don't always give that it, well, what we'll do is we will we'll go down to my own net so this is the town you get this every single day right there so you tap on it and boom there's a bolt right there beautiful 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 and often if you visit players farms as well as on your own farm there'll be one mystery box per day I find sometimes more although you can't always open them on the second or third try without spending diamonds but as you can see I got one from there and we'll just visit we'll visit a few players farms and see if we can right there right there we tap it and there we go two mallets this is uh, awesome for the examples it's working really well so another great way right there to get a whole heap of different items which works really well Another way is indeed the Wheel of Awesome. Now, the Wheel of Awesome doesn't always have them on it, but it does in this case have a mallet on it and a spade. But it doesn't have a plank uh, this time around, but still, there are items on it. So, we'll give it a spin. And 3, 2, 1, let's go. And it's here. It's free way, so, so it's awesome, awesome way to do it. So, there we go. We got a green voucher that time, but you get, win something anyway, but you sometimes get something awesome. Now, so that's one way of doing it. There's also, if you go fishing, you also, the chances that I'll get it first try are very, very low, but uh, we'll give it a we'll give it a try we'll give it a try and you can indeed get items from fishing which which works out fine as well as in the mystery nets although they do cost diamonds to do if you uh, you could get them through that well oh, uh, just get this one here get this one here oh and boom so not that time but that's okay but you can get them from fishing as well as making products and the mystery nets which i mentioned and the mystery packages which if you come you collect all there we go there's the uh, the well you know there's because if you tap on them like that then you go like that you can see the planks you can get and you can see the percentage of getting each of those so you can indeed get like those kind of things throughout those packages which is another awesome way to get them so that's that way that way and oh yeah the trees and bushes the trees and bushes so by what you can do is by harvesting these eventually you get them via that way as well so these so if you if you have lots of bushes and trees and you harvest them and you cut them down you can indeed get different items from doing that as well so we'll just there we go I'll just see if there's any I can it's oh this one here we can cut down that one and we'll just see sometimes the chances it will be that one are not very high so it gives a 5 XP we'll try one more Oh, that one there that one there that one there there we go we might if we're lucky that one there you know so just XP XP 
And that one there. Okay, and just one more, and just in case we can get it, you know, like that. Boom. And this one here, probably just XP as well. Boom. Yeah, okay, but you can indeed get it from doing that as well. Now, another way, and the final way. So, that, that, that are some of the different ways. Another way is indeed that you can indeed buy them. So, you can buy them as deals, like this deal here, which I wouldn't recommend buying it as that deal. Or you can just buy the diamonds, like so, and then you can buy them via, for example, increased storage, and you can just pay the diamonds to get them. Now, some if you have diamonds, it's a great way to do it, but if you don't have a lot of diamonds, which most free-to-play players don't I wouldn't recommend doing that way but if you do have lots of diamonds you can indeed you can indeed buy them if you so wish via that way and if you end up with an imbalance like for example we come here and I have way more tape than I have planks I can trade with hood members and for example say I'll give you 20 20 tape if you give me 20 planks and then it can balance them out really well and so that indeed is 10 ways the 10 10 best ways well, like 10 only ways really that you can make the make get, get lots and lots of planks Planks, lots and lots of bolts and duct tape and all the different items and indeed get a big barn big silo upgrade all the town buildings expand all your land out that's just that part I still have more to go over here and yeah it can be awesome so that is going to wrap up this video I hope you enjoyed it let me know in the comments what is your rare item is that you get less planks panels or whatnot and which tip did you find most helpful so yeah hope you have a wonderful day smash the like button be sure to subscribe and see you next time and remember to make coins faster than honeybees Make honey.